Resistance is. Resistance is. Resistance is. Resistance is. To smuggle a loaf of bread was to resist. To teach in secret was to resist. To gather information and distribute an underground newsletter was to resist. To cry out warning and shatter illusions was to resist. To rescue a Torah school was to resist. To forge documents was to resist. To smuggle people across borders was to resist. To chronicle events and conceal the records was to resist. To extend a helping hand to those in need was to resist. To dare to speak out at the risk of one's life was to resist. To stand empty-handed against the killers was to resist. To reach the besieged smuggling weapons and commands was to resist. To take up arms in streets, mountains, and forests was to resist. To rebel in the death camps was to resist. To rise up in the ghettos amid tumbling walls in the most desperate revolt humanity has ever known. We arrived at Auschwitz uh, on April the 20th of 1943. Hitler's birthday, first day of Passover, and uh, unbeknown to us, the uh, uprising at, uh, at Warsaw Ghetto. We had to appear every so often naked in front of a non-commissioned officer, SS officer, who would look at us if that prisoner still would be able to work uh, fine. If he thinks or thought that uh, the prisoner would not be able to work, we knew and used the term going through the chimney, being burned, gassed and burned. We were taught, uh, when you work, don't work too hard. Work very hard with your eyes. When you saw somebody coming, you had a full shovel. And when uh, you didn't see anybody, you looked around, you had a little bit of shovel. Again, instinctively, I'm not going to give in. We all kind of help and help each other, and not giving in uh, was the secret of that we survived.